Good morning, everyone. I'm Miss Davina, and welcome to our very first live stream story time. So if you are new to us today, we normally have pre-recorded uh, story time videos that you can access on our YouTube channel through our uh, website here at the Public Library for Union County. But we are, since we are going live today, you can view it live. We're also going to save it and upload it to our YouTube channel as well. So you can go back and view it if you were unable to join us for our live stream. So let's go ahead and sing our hello song. Ready? Everyone help me out. Hello everybody and how are you? How are you? Hello everybody and how are you? Again. Hello everybody and how are you? How are you? Hello everybody and how are you? So how are you today? I know it's starting to get colder out and today is what? December 1st. It's the first day of December and it's the countdown to Christmas. And today's topic is going to be winter. And the first day of winter is not until closer to Christmas on the 21st, but um, we're gonna start with the topic of winter because we always think of December as a winter month. So my first book that I have for us is called Winter. And it's one of the Abdo Seasons books by Julie Murray. Winter. Winter is one of the four seasons. And remember, do you remember what the seasons are? We have spring, summer, winter, fall. And we're still in fall right now, but we're getting ready to go into winter. The air is cold in winter as the days get shorter. And look at them. Look at that pretty tree with the lights and there's what on the ground? Snow. And what color is the snow? Right? It's white. Remember like you're pulling on your white shirt. White. And the days start to get shorter, don't they? That means it gets dark earlier and it doesn't get light until later in the morning. Snow falls and it covers the ground. And sometimes here in Pennsylvania, we get a lot of snow. And it's been a long time since we've had this much snow that we could walk down the middle of the road, right? But we might this year, we don't know. Maybe we'll get that much snow. Some animals sleep all winter long. And what kind of animal is that? What do you think? Right, that's a polar bear. And his fur doesn't look as white because it's next to the white snow, but polar bear's fur goes turns white so they can blend in with the snow while they're sleeping. People try to stay warm. They wear hats and mittens. And where do your hats go? On your heads. And what about your mittens? Do they go on your feet? No, that's right, they go on your hands. And look at that, he's got a curious, he's got a sock monkey hat. I like that hat, that's pretty cool. And they're riding on a toboggan. I love to sled in the snow. That's one of my favorite things to do. Oh my goodness, what's he doing here? Because winter can be a lot of fun, can it? They're doing what? She's building a snowman. And what color is the snowman's nose? What do you think? Right, it's orange. The snowman's orange nose is orange. His eyes are green. And look at the little girl's gloves and her coat are two different shades of, you tell me, blue. Very good. Maria goes sledding and Tom goes skating. What color is Maria wearing? Now it might look different to you, so I'll take two answers and they're really close. Some might think that it looks red and some might think that it looks pink. So either one would be right. I'm not sure exactly, it's hard to tell. And look, he's ice skating on the ice and she's sledding on the snow. The snow piles up high and Mary helps shovel it. Do you ever help shovel the snow? 
That's a lot of hard work. And sometimes that's why adults don't like snow as much is because of all the work it takes to, to clear the snow. And they also have to kind of try to drive in it, which makes it hard. So what will you do this winter? Oh, what are they doing? That's right, they're skiing. And they're playing in the snow. What color is his coat? Yellow and blue and pink. And let's see what other color. Oh, what color is the snow? White. Very good. So what are you going to do this winter to have fun? And you can type into the, um, re the comments below in the chat and let Miss Davina know what you like to do for fun in the snow and in the winter time. Because not everybody does the same thing. Some of us do different things for one. Some of us just like to cuddle up in front of a fire with hot cocoa and a book or watch a move, watch Christmas movies this time of year. So everybody has different things that they like to do to have fun in the winter. So our first song that we have is called Warm Clothes for When It Snows. And it goes to the tune of The Farmer in the Dell. And we're first we're gonna talk about our hat, our scarf, our gloves, and then our boots. So where does your hat go? On your head. What about your scarf? Does that go around your waist? No, it goes on your neck. So show me your neck, neck. What about your gloves? Do you put those on your feet and walk in the snow with your gloves on? No, they go on your hands, right? And what about your boots? Your boots go on your, on your feet. Very good. So let's go ahead and we'll sing this song. And like I said, it goes to the tune of the farmer in the dell. My hat goes on my head. My hat goes on my head. Warm clothes for when it snows. My hat goes on my head. And we can go like this for warm and just give ourselves a big hug and snow. Remember, you wiggle your fingers and it kind of drifts down slowly. So let's do that again. My hat goes on my head. My hat goes on my head. Warm clothes for when it snows. My hat goes on my head. My scarf goes on my neck. My scarf goes round my neck. Warm clothes for when it snows. My scarf goes round my neck. My gloves go on my hands, my gloves go on my hands. Warm clothes for when it snows, my gloves go on my hands. My boots go on my feet, my boots go on my feet. Warm clothes for when it snows, my boots, they hold my body heat. Ooh, that changed up on us, didn't it? So, warm clothes for when it snows, they hold my body heat. We can do that one more time. So we'll do it again. Ready? So help Miss Davina sing this song again. Ready? And you should know this one. We'll try to go a little faster. My hat goes on my head. My hat goes on my head. Warm clothes for when it snows. My hat goes on my head. My scarf goes round my neck. My scarf goes round my neck. Warm clothes for when it snows. My scarf goes round my neck. My gloves go on my hands, my gloves go on my hands. Warm clothes for when it snows, my gloves go on my hands. My boots go on my feet, my boots go on my feet. Warm clothes for when it snows, they hold my body heat. And so when you put your warm clothes on and hats and boots and everything that helps keep you warm because it's holding in your body heat because your body makes heat, and if it's cold outside and you have a layer on, a couple layers on, it keeps the heat inside and helps you stay warmer. That's right. So this book that I have for us is called Winter Is Here. And, oh, what's this? Right, that's a dog. Who remembers the sign for dog? Does anybody remember? What do you think? Very good. So if you can't snap your fingers, it's okay. You can pretend. So it's snap and slap your leg like you're telling the dog to come here. So it's dog. So pretend to snap and slap. Or you can just slap and that's also the sign for dog. So this is by Kevin Henkes and it's illustrated. And what did we say an illustrator is? The person who draws the pictures by Laura Dronzek. Winter is here for Will and Clara. Oh, look 
at the kids and what are they doing? They're playing with their sleds, they're on the pond ice skating, they're building a snowman. Winter is here. It's everywhere. So they're they're playing outside in the snow and on the ice. They're walking their dogs and there's a what kind of bird is this? Does anybody know? It's a red cardinal. Oh, and what animal is this? A squirrel. Look at the dog. He's after the squirrel. He's like, I want that squirrel. Dogs like to chase squirrels in case you didn't know. It's falling from the sky. Look at the snow coming down. See all the snow? And sitting on the houses. So there's lots of pretty snow. It's on the houses. It's on the grass and dripping from the roofs. Look at that. There's what? Icicles coming down too because of the heat from the house is making the snow melt and then it's freezing in the cold air. And sticking to the trees in clumps and curls. Oh, look at all those animals. Tell me what animals you can see in these pictures. We'll start with this page. What, what animals do you see? I see a dog. What's this one? What color is the dog first? What color is the dog? Brown dog and a white cat. Remember whiskers for cat? And is there any, oh, what's this? What's this? I think that's a bunny rabbit and he's what color? Can you see the color? Right, he's gray, gray. And there's a red cardinal and gray squirrels. And how many squirrels are there? There are two gray squirrels. And Miss Davina's gonna wave her arms because the light just turned off on her, okay? So here we go. I'm gonna wave my arms and see if I can get the light to turn back on. There we go. Sometimes things are silly when you're live, aren't they? And what about the little boy? What color shirt is he wearing? He's wearing a blue shirt. So there, there's a lot of snow coming down in this picture, in this book. Winter is reaching through the branches. Oh, look at everybody trying to keep warm and crunching, crouching in the doorways. So there's a lot of winter happening in this picture, isn't there? Oh, what animal is that? That's an owl. What sound does an owl make? You tell me. Right. Hoo, hoo, hoo. Everybody hoo like an owl with me. Ready? Hoo, hoo. And settling here and there softly, so softly. So the snow is falling really soft. It's not blowing hard in the wind, but winter can be hard too. Ice covers the pond. The leaves underneath are like stars in glass. See all those leaves? And do you remember the sign for leaf? It's been a long time since we did that one. Does anybody remember? So if this is a branch and you hold your hand down and you dangle it like that, leaf. So the leaves are under the ice on the pond and the dog is like, why can't I get them? It can take a long time to get ready for winter. Look at him here. He's all ready, but look at all the steps that he has to go through. What does he have to do? Boots and zippers and vests and zippers, and what? And jackets, and zippers, and hats, and snaps, and scarves, and mittens. Oh, what color is this scarf? That's Miss Davina's favorite color. Who remembers? Right, purple. So pink is the P on the lip or on the chin and purple is the P and shake it. 
So Miss Davina's favorite color is purple and he has a purple scarf on. That's a lot of steps to put on to get ready for winter. Let's count them all, ready? So let's see if we can count all these steps. Let me see if I can turn the book so we can see them. Ready, one, two, three, four, five, six. So remember six is the pinky and thumb touch. Six steps just to get ready to go outside and play in the snow. That's why sometimes it takes a long time. And if you have to go to the bathroom, you gotta get all undressed to come back inside. And I know myself, when I was younger, I didn't. I went, waited to the last minute because I didn't wanna have to come inside and get all undressed. Winter is outside, of course, but it's inside too. Oh my, look at the puppy dog. Feathering the window and dusting the dog and sitting on the table. What's he making? A a snowman out of, looks like cotton balls and glue. And I'm not sure what the what the black is. Who remembers the sign for black? Right, remember your finger across your forehead like you got a line of dirt from your hat on your forehead. Winter comes without a sound. And it comes with many sounds. What is that? That's a snow plow and snow plows can be really loud. The wind howls in every language. So see how the wind is blowing in the picture? And the windows rattle. Sometimes the wind is so strong it makes the windows shake. Winter is white and gray. So remember white and gray, gray. But with the dark of night, winter is blue. Blue, blue, deep blue, and even colder. Ooh. And when winter comes, see how it's just starting to fall? And then it stays and stays and stays. I hope we don't have a long winter this year. I don't like long winters. I'm ready. For, I'm a spring and summer person, but sometimes winter is pretty. And when it's time to leave, winter shrinks away bit by bit. It slows down, getting smaller, drying up, and slipping down the street and around the corner. Oh my goodness, what did he lose? Somebody lost their mitten. Peeking back, then moving on. And here comes the robin. That means spring is coming. Out into the world, into the air, into spring. So winter leads into spring, right? So we're in fall right now. Remember the four seasons? We have what? We have spring, summer, fall, and winter. So that was our book, our other book about winter. And the song that I have is Hat, Scarf, Mittens, Boots, and it goes to the tune of Head and Shoulders, Knees and Toes. So where does your hat go? Your hat goes on your head, your scarf goes around your neck, your mittens go where? On your hands, then your boots are on your feet, warm and cozy in the snow. So let's do this, and we'll do it at least two times. Ready? Hat, scarf, mittens, boots, mittens, boots, mittens, boots. Hat, scarf, mittens, boots, warm and cozy in the snow. Do you want to do that again faster? Yeah, let's do it faster, ready? Hat, scarf, mittens, boots. Oh, I messed up already. Mittens, boots, mittens, boots. Hat, scarf, mittens, boots. Warm and cozy in the snow. Let's do that again. Let's go faster even. 
hat, scarf, mittens, boots, mittens, boots, mittens, boots, hat, scarf, mittens, boots, warm and cozy in the snow. Do you think we can go really, really fast? Remember, we have to stay together, right? So everybody help Miss Davina sing this really, really fast. Ready? Here we go. Hat, scarf, mittens, boots, mittens, boots, mittens, boots, hat, scarf, mittens, boots, warm and cozy in the snow. I almost messed up. Did you get it? Did you mess up? That's okay. Just keep practicing. And remember, practice. Practice is something. It's okay if you mess up with songs. Miss Davina messes up all the time. And messing up is how we learn how to do it right a lot of times, too. So we can do that one more time. We'll go really, really fast. And then we'll sing our goodbye song. Ready? Here we go. Hat, scarf, mittens, boots, mittens, boots, mittens, boots, hat, scarf, mittens, boots, warm and cozy in the snow. Good job. Good job. Remember, this is thank you. So thank you for helping Miss Davina sing our song. And good is like thank you only into your hand. Good work or job. Remember, it's like a nail and a hammer. So this is your nail and this is your hammer pounding work. So good. Thank you. Good job. That was really great. And I hope you'll join us next time. So we will have links in the description below once we get this loaded to our YouTube channel where you can find all kinds of activities that go along with our story time. And, um, Miss Davina's email and different things so that if you want to know and we, we hope to be doing our live stream video on Facebook every Tuesday up until right before Christmas at least um, at 10 a.m. So again if you're unable to join us at 10 it'll be um, it'll be saved and we'll save it to our YouTube channel that you can get on um, right from the library website. So help Miss Davina sing our goodbye song. Remember, we can wave like this or like this. It doesn't matter however you want to wave. And then we clap our hands for everybody and all our friends who joined us today. Ready? We wave goodbye like this. We wave goodbye like this. We wave goodbye to all our friends. We wave goodbye like this. We clap our hands like this. We clap our hands like this. We clap our hands for all our friends. We clap our hands like this. Yay! That was wonderful. Thank you. Goodbye.